Professor, I used to study your runes. I love the runes. <laughs> I put the runes in prunes. <laughs> Did you? I love the runes. Oh, um, not so keen on the prunes, though. <laughs> well, yes, they do have their uses. <laughs> now, oh, yeah, I've, I've just been looking at the book of the runes. I've been thinking, you know. Yes. Each day of the week has its own rune. We are a funny oh, country, England. We're really unusual. Old, we? Yes. It's good to be a bit weird. <laughs> there's, a, there's a story about oh, weird. Oh, there's as well. another one, isn't we'll it? We'll tell you that too. But um, uh, each day, I've got some runes here. I've just been sorting them out. Um, these are runes carved into clay or, or pressed into clay yes. before it's fired and then blackened so you can read it. And uh, Manaz it stands for Moon Day, you see. Today is Moon Day. It so is. Happy Moon Day to you. Happy Moon Day, um, So we've got the, the letter M there, Manaz. Yes. And uh, Manaz is the self. It's about you. It's, uh, it's washing day. And, uh, <laughs> it's washing day. Uh, two as day. Our, our days of the week are named after the old gods of the English. Um, we don't seem to realise it. But when we say hello, we say hey, hello, din. Odin or oh, Woden house. Uh, the English say hello. We don't say Guten Morgen or <laughs> come on, son. We don't say that. We say hail Odin, but we shorten it now because we're lazy as well. Yeah. And so we say hello. <laughs> um, uh, two hours days, two hours sky father. Um, two hours Tuesday, of course. Two is still spelt Tuesday. Yes. Woden as day or Odin. Odin if you're Norse or Scandinavian. That's the O rune. So this is the rune of Wednesday, Woden as day or um, uh, Woden as I mean yeah. we, 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 we still, still spell, spell it Wednesday, like that, don't yeah. we? Yeah, it's Woden as day. And then Thor's day. Um Thor's day is another one. Oh, it's back there again. You swap it down there. Yes. Two as day. Thor's day is as well as two as day. And then Freya's day. Freya's the goddess of love. <laughs> oh, how lovely. Yeah. And then there's Saturn and Sun. Yes. The Saturn, the, the sky Saturn, which was uh, one of the planets, the wandering planets. Yes. So what we've got is the days of the week in runes. And each of the runes means something uh, of themselves. Like T, the T rune is the sign of Sky Father and it's the warrior's rune of power and protection. But also, you could write your name in runes, couldn't you? Oh, yes. And unless you love and know the runes, you won't be able to know what's been written. You could write a letter to friends. Codes. Secrets. Secrets. And you can write secret notes to people. And... Um, uh, write yes. a letter to Father Christmas, who is two as the Sky Father, the Saxon God of Tuesday, tomorrow, two as day. Um, he rode across the sky in a sleigh pulled by reindeer. See anyone you know? Wow. <laughs> two as Sky Father. And he brought the great gift every year. The gift, as the Saxons called it, was snow. Um, uh, uh, snow, they called the gift. Frost and snow is very important to farming people because that breaks up the soil. You can plough. You plough before Christmas. Clean off your ploughshare. Shove it under your bed. Forget about that till next year because then the frost comes and breaks up the ploughshare. And, uh, and uh, it's the great gift of two hours, Sky Father. And Father Christmas still brings you presents. Of course he does. And he understands the runes. Oh, it's wonderful. We love the runes. Write letters to people in runes. They'll love it. Confuse them. <laughs> we love that too. Have fun with history. <laughs> Fantastic, Bye Professor. Now. Bye. Bye.